Hello. I gotta put my glasses on. I gotta get some socks on. the 29th yeah it's the 29th of december 2022 it's the last normal day i feel like of 2022 since it's new year's eve tomorrow which is fun i am i have very much mixed feelings about like 2022 being over because i feel like 2022 was a big year i went to nine concerts i believe yeah nine concerts and i felt like i found myself this year yeah <laughs> is that weird to say i just i feel like i figured out a lot of stuff this year and i'm really happy about this year but also i'm really sad about this year i don't know I'm happy to be done with this year, but I'm also sad to let go of this year because this year was really like mixed. It was really, there was a lot of good times and there was too many bad times. You know what I mean? You can't get enough of good times. Like good times is the best, but there shouldn't be that many bad times. And there have been a lot of bad times, but I guess everyone goes through stuff and yeah like i don't know i don't know what to say about 2022 because it's been so mixed it hasn't been a bad year but it's not been the best year either you know what i mean but i have had the best experiences in 2022 like ever uh i'm gonna let me just talk a little bit about my 2022 highlights so all of my concerts i went to First, I went to the Louis concert, which was the start of everything. I, I feel like that was the start of a new chapter for me. I had the best time ever. The first time I fainted, though. Um, so that was an experience, I guess. But yeah, I went to the Louis concert, and then I went to... I was supposed to see Tate McRae, but she got COVID, and she said she would reschedule. It hasn't happened yet, but I, it's probably going to happen soon. Uh, and then after Louis, I saw Sigrid, and then I saw... I had three concerts in May, so May was a good, good month. And after Sigrid, I saw Tommy, and after Tommy, I saw Gracie. Uh, Gracie was one of my, one of the best times ever I've had in my life. I was not the biggest Gracie Abrams fan be before, like, I went to the concert, but I listened to, like, two, three of her songs, and those were some of my favorite songs, right? And I've always, for, like, two years, since I heard Stay by Grace Abrams for the first time, I've wanted to like listen to more of her music. So I listened to I Miss You, I'm Sorry and stuff. And then I didn't really like listen to a lot of her music other than those two songs. And then I decided, cause I saw she was coming to Norway and I was like, I want to go so bad because of those two songs. And I have always wanted to listen to more of her music and get to know her as an artist. And then I went to the concert and it was one of the best experiences I've had in my whole entire life. And now she's my favorite artist. I love her so much. And I got to talk to her and everything. She's the sweetest ever. She's so kind-hearted and so wise and so talented she is the most talented person that i've ever met in my whole entire life so that was a little bit about my gracie concert and then after gracie i saw dua lipa and then after dua i saw harry um and then after harry i saw alec benjamin and then after alec benjamin i saw karpem which i vlogged and after karpem i saw otp only the poets um and it was amazing that was the 29th of october so it was right before halloween and it was a really really good concert so 
I've been to, yeah, that was nine concerts, right? It's been a big concert year for me, I guess. Uh, and the only two concerts I've planned for next year are, um, I'm, I'm seeing Louie again, which I'm so incredibly excited for. Super, super excited for. And then I'm seeing Nile, which I can't even talk about. I'm going to start crying if I talk th about that. I'm so excited. I'm going to uh, what's called Stavan Festival in Norway. And I'm seeing so many of my favorite artists. I'm seeing Emma Steinbakken, which I love. She's a Norwegian artist. Go listen to her if you haven't. I'm going to see Chris Holsten, which is also a Norwegian artist. And Dagne. And also a Norwegian artist. Most of these are Norwegian besides Nile. <laughs> Bolin. Which is, uh, if you know, if you're Norwegian, you probably know what Bolin is, so. And then Kaigo, Karpe, also, I'm seeing them again, which is, which is really, really exciting. A lot of great artists, and no, I'm so excited. Uh, so that's gonna be great. Other than that, 2022, other than concerts, I have been writing a lot of music which is fun for me because <laughs> i love to write music and so i've been doing that made a lot of songs this year which has been really really fun and exciting or i finished what in norwegian we call grunskolen i'm out of 10th grade uh which is bittersweet because it's like fun but it's also it was really sad i also got diagnosed with adhd and Tourette syndrome, which is, I don't know, it is what it is. And trips, I went to Spain again, which is super fun, and I went to Sweden, which those two trips were were so, so fun. If you haven't watched my Spain vlogs, go and watch them. I had COVID, I think two times this year. This year, I finally got to spend Christmas with my mom's side of the family, and it was great. And I learned a lot by myself this year, I guess. So, this year has been great. Found a lot of new YouTubers that I love and new mu music that I love. So that was amazing. There was a lot of good experiences this year. And I'm also really, really excited for 2023. Because I think that 2023 will be a really, really good year. I don't know, I just feel like it. So excited for 2023 let's get into the video because i've been talking for 15 minutes now so i've got a lot to edit but that's fine uh i'm gonna show you my uh to-do list two sec also i've been obsessed with the show boy meets world at the moment it's on disney plus and these are not in order but i need to clear my room first and then the rest of them i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm gonna do them so i need to clean my room because my room's a mess, so I'm gonna change my sheets, vacuum, clean everything, tidy, everything. And then I need to wash my work pants because I do building and construction at school and uh, I need to wash my work pants because of that. And then I need to film a YouTube video, which is going to be my 2023 TBR, so to be read. The books I want to read in 2023, or the books I'm most excited to read in 2023. Uh, and that's probably up already when you see this video. Uh, after I film that video, I need to make some wall decor. Uh, I'm gonna show you later when I actually make the wall decor what I'm talking about, but I'm gonna show you. And then I need to take a shower. Okay, so I didn't even get to start cleaning before my dad came downstairs and told me that I have to go uh, for a walk with Louis. So I'm gonna go for a walk with Louis. But I'm not going to film that because I'm not in the mood to bring my camera out when it's snowing. So, or it's not snowing, but it's cold outside. So. Uh, but I'm going to see you when I'm home from the walk with Louis. Okay, I came home from my walk with Louis about half an hour ago. And uh, it's now... Um, can you see it? It's 16.55. This is my background in Nile. It's my favorite picture of Nile, like, ever. And it's my background. And I also love the t-shirt because it says crazy mofos, crazy motherfuckers. Very funny. <laughs> I'm home now and I'm going to start cleaning and tidying my room. 
Um, and I think it's gonna take about two hours because I have to unpack my bags. Let's clean. Okay, so I'm FaceTiming with my friend Ida. Well, <laughs> there she is. That's her. Okay, so I just finished talking to Ida, and my dad said that it's dinner in like 45 minutes. Uh, so I'm just going to finish tidying everything. I'm almost done. As you can see, but I just need to take my rug away and my vinyls and uh, my guitar and my trash cans and everything from the floor so that I can vacuum. And then after I've vacuumed, I'm going to clean and then I'm going to change my sheets and then take a shower. And then I think, because uh, I think I can be able to do that within 45 minutes. And then after that, I'm going to go upstairs and eat. And then when I come downstairs, I'm going to do everything else that I need to do. Maybe I'll film tomorrow too. I don't know, but... Okay, what is this? Uh, for Christmas, I got new sheets from my aunt and my uncle and look at these! It's the cutest thing ever! I'm obsessed. How cute! I love it. I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love. So there was uh, this one day I was scrolling on Pinterest and I found this photo and I got so inspired that I wished for... Actually, I was walking around for like three months, four or five months actually, just thinking, oh my god, I should buy yellow, like light yellow sheets. And then Christmas came around and I called my mom and I was like, yeah, I'm on Ikea and I'm going to check if they have uh, light yellow bed sheets because I really want that for my room. And my mom was like, yeah, that would be so cute, but isn't it better if you wish for it for Christmas? Uh, and then I said like, oh yeah, that's probably better because then I won't like have to use my money on that. And then I wished for it for Christmas. I love it. Oh my god, look what just happened. I knew it would happen. It's fine, I'm gonna fix it. What time is it? It's currently... Focus. 11.09 p.m. It's way too late. I thought it would be like 10 or something, but it's 11.09. Not happy about that at all, but that's fine. Let me just check off the things we have done. I think I've only done one thing, to be honest. But I'm gonna check <laughs> if I've done anything more than I think I have. Which, let's pray to God that I have, but I haven't. I know that I haven't. Uh, productivity, Notion. 
Okay, I've cleaned my room. My dad actually did wash my work pants, so I've done that. And now I'm gonna go shower, and then I only have to film my 2023 TBR, make wall decor, and make workout plans. And I can do that. Also, I like doing this stuff at night time, so it's fine. But I think I'm gonna make uh, the wall decor before I do workout plans and filming. But I'm gonna shower now, right now. I think I'm maybe gonna go upstairs and get some Coca-Cola before I shower, but... Maybe I'm gonna add it tonight too, I don't know. We'll see. And I hate it! Woo! Okay, I just came out of the shower. I'm gonna put the camera somewhere else. Okay, I just came out of the shower. I put on this long sleeve and my school hoodie, or it's not my school hoodie, but I bought it and then I got my school logo on it. It's here. It says Bell and then student. Bell is by the like building and construction, but it's in Norwegian, obviously. And then I'm just wearing my pajama pants. My other pair of pajama pants. Is it focusing? I think it's focusing. I feel like it's focusing. So, I need to fill my water bottle. But, let's go fill up my water bottle and then make some wall decor. Okay, so while I decided that while I do this, I'm gonna watch Boy Meets World because it's my favorite show in the whole entire world at the moment. Literally love it so much. It's so good and I really recommend to anyone who haven't watched Boy Meets World. It's an amazing show. So go watch, watch that. Also, I decided that I'm going to ha make this video a two-day vlog, so I'm going to vlog tomorrow, too. Or doing productive stuff tomorrow, too. Okay. It's now... 4.51 a.m. I've not done anything. I've been talking on FaceTime with my best friend, Yanni, and I've had a lovely time talking with her, but totally forgot to do what I had to do. Just not the vibe. But I'm gonna wake up tomorrow, if I'm able to wake up, I'm gonna wake up tomorrow and do the things that I've left to do. Um, and also try to film my YouTube video in daylight. So let's pray to God that that works. Now I'm gonna go to sleep, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. See you in the morning. Okay, so it's 12.49 p.m. I woke up at 11. Um, I got to sleep at 7 yesterday. <laughs> or not yesterday, this morning. I went to sleep at 7 this morning. I was supposed to like, be like productive and healthy in this video. Yeah, we're not gonna think about that and we're gonna continue on doing what we started yesterday. I'm just going to continue making wall decor and I'm going to make at least two of them. Uh, and then I'm going to film my YouTube video and I'm going to actually, the workout plans, I'm, <laughs> I'm going to use them in another video. So we're not doing the workout plans today. Or we're doing it today, but I'm going to film another video for it. You know what I mean? Also, I've, I found this YouTuber that I really liked. I think her name is, what's her name? Amelia Rose is her name. And she has 3.61K 
um, subscribers. But go and watch her, because I really like her channel. Okay, I just want to say, to, I just want to tell you guys something. So, this is my favorite, you can't read it, I'm going to read it for you. Uh, it's my favorite quote or motivational quote or, I don't know, sentence. <laughs> Simply, it's my favorite sentence ever. So, it says, it's this little thing found on Pinterest. I think you can read it now, maybe, but... It says, that dream was planted in your heart for a reason. Isn't that, like, this... It's kind of like, it, that's so true. It's so true. Just, just wanted to tell you guys that because I love this quote, sentence, I don't know, very much. It's my favorite one ever. Sure. That's it. I'm gonna finish though. I have uh, three left on that wall and then I'm gonna put something beside it like there and then I have Four left on that wall, I think so I have seven left in total but now I'm going to just quickly tidy my desk because of everything that I've been doing um, and then I'm gonna make the what I'm most excited to read in 2023 video. Yeah. Okay, I just finished filming uh, my what I want to read in 2023 video, and now my sister is going to do my makeup and then. I'm going to put on my outfit for New Year's Eve and then we're going to leave for the New Year's party. So since I am done doing everything that I needed to do in this video, now I'm going to end the video here. So I hope you liked this video. It was a little bit chaotic uh, since I was literally up till 7 <laughs> this morning. Uh, and didn't finish everything I had to do yesterday, but I hope you liked this video And if you did subscribe and click the notification bell so that you know when I post videos because that's fun. So Yeah, happy New Year's by the way. Happy New Year because it's The 31st of December. So happy New Year. I hope you have a great 2023. I love you My sister wants to say bye Bye <laughs>